My name is George Faux. I am postulator for the cause of canonization of Maria Refugio Aguilar, foundress of the Mercedarian Sisters of the Blessed Sacrament. Maria del Refugio was the eldest of eight children. She was forced to marry. It wasn't a happy marriage, the ceremony, but she came to love her husband. Maria Refugio as a wife, she was very devout. She was willing to support her husband in his ambitions to become a high politician. And something very important in this relationship is that she really converted her husband who was, he was a Catholic, but he was not practicing. So he died being a committed Catholic. When her husband died, she fell into a very deep depression and she's invited to these spiritual exercises. She went because it was the right thing to do for a woman of her position. During this uh, week of spiritual exercises, she had an encounter with God. She revalued the Eucharist in her life and she left the exercises completely transformed. This encounter with God and revaluing the Eucharist had consequences. The first was a tremendous joy, and discovering the joy of living, the joy of being loved, and I would say even the joy of motherhood. And this joy will stay with her for her entire life. And this joy she was feeling urged her to thank God by spreading love for the Blessed Sacrament. And this means sharing her own experience with other people in order that they may experience this same encounter with, with the Eucharist. Maria Refugio used to visit her daughter once a month in Morelia. Once she entered the cathedral in Morelia, she was praying before the Blessed Sacrament and uh, she had this inspiration that uh, she should found a community of adorers of the Blessed Sacrament who would also have schools in order to teach children how to live the Eucharist. She had friends in Morelia and there were several who liked the idea and so a group of about 10 started meeting. As a foundress, when the community was founded, it was founded just as a Eucharistic congregation to share this desire of teaching children how to live the Eucharist in everyday life. It took some time before they were approved. Finally, the, the Archbishop was convinced and because it had been a Mercedarian friar who had helped them, it was in order to thank Our Lady of Mercy that they became Mercedarians. The cause of canonization of Maria Refugio is in the Roman faith. She has already been declared venerable. That means that heroical virtues have been approved. We had to prove fame of sanctity and we were able to do it by providing 10,000 testimonies of favors granted through her intercession. And uh, we have 28 possible miracles that have to be studied. So I invite you all first to know more about Maria del Refugio and I also invite you to ask her intercession in your needs. The message that Maria del Refugio gives the world nowadays is that she herself found in the spiritual exercises in 1895 to rediscover, revalue the Eucharist in our own lives then to live in gratitude to God.